Since the dawn of humanity, the moon has always been an object that demands our attention. What is this bright object in the night sky? Was it a place where the gods lived out their lives? Was it another realm with other peoples living on? Could you ever visit it? In December of 1968, we answered that question. We have committed. We have It was not another realm, nor was it the home of the gods. No. It was a destination. A destination that three very real humans were going to explore. These epic men of flesh and blood were going to explore a world that only the gods themselves would have presided over in ancient times. By the end of the Apollo program, the moon was not merely some otherworldly body, but rather, it was a destination that had been conquered by humanity. Twenty-four humans have visited that desolate rock in the night sky, and twelve have walked upon her surface. But not once since 1972 has humanity returned. We left that new world and instead favored the old. And while it may seem as if we have given up and come home, we were merely preparing for the next journey. And now, in the year 2021, a rocket to rival the Saturn V itself is stacked inside the VAB of old. Poised to return us to the realm of myth and legend. Standing nearly 322 feet tall, the Space Launch System rocket is finally here. She will return us to the moon, and this time we will not turn back. We will build reusable landers, we will build lunar space stations, and we will build a colony on the surface of the moon. And all this will be in preparation for a trip no human has ever dared undertake. But we shall press forward to the moon and then rocket onto Mars. And while Mars may seem like an impossible destination worthy only of science fiction, the launch of this very first Artemis mission brings Mars from the realm of legend to the realm of possibility. We are going, and nothing is going to stop us. <laughs>